Hello Inventors, in this video we will learn how we can use animation in MIT App Inventor projects. So let me show you how we can use it. So first of all start new project. Don't worry we are not going to use your web browser. We will use your some extensions. Okay. So that's the project name and the project name is use animation. And now okay. So that's the first screen of my app here. Now I'm going to use here one layout and that layout is virtual arrangement like this and make this one in a fill parent like this. Now I'm going to use here one extension that is Loti view extension. So what is Loti? So Loti animation is the website. Let me just open that Loti animation. Just search here and you will find your lotifiles.com. That's the website here and there are a lot of animation free of cost. So let me show you the animation. So just you can just search animation here. So just suppose robot robot and just enter and you can see there are a lot of robot animation here. You can see. So while we creating the app like chatbot or something. So at the time we will use all these animation in our screen here. You can see like this. Let me just uh, search your login screen. So just search your login and then enter and you will get the animation or animated images related to login page. So you can see that's the animation. So you can use that animation or that image in our front page of uh, login. Okay. So you can use that type of animation in your screen. So let me just show you how we can use it. So suppose I want to use that uh, that animation, this one animation in my first screen. So just open that animation first of all. Okay. Like this and copy that URL. You can see that's the URL. Just copy this. Now let me just go to the MIT app inventor here and uh, we need to use your one extension. So open that extension. I will give you that link in the description. That extension name is Loti view extension. Okay. And we need to download the AIX file. Here you can see that's the AIX file. Download this. Go to the MIT app inventor. In the left side, you can see the extension. Click on import extension and import that extension like this and import it. Now drag and drop that extension here and now go to the block section and we need to just click on that Loti view. And you can see the create view, just use this and the layout I'm to use your vertical arrangement, this one. So I will just choose this one here and the SRC URL. So click on text and use your that normal text field and go to the your Loti view uh, here image. And you can see that's the animation URL. Just copy that URL, go to the app inventor here and then just paste it here like this. Now click on that screen and we will display that uh, animation in the in a screen in a slideation like this. So this will display the as it is uh, Loti view like this. You can see that's the uh, that's the view. If you want to decrease the size or width or if you want to set the size and width. So you have to use another component. You can see that one is custom view. So whenever you use this one, so you can define the layout. So if I just suppose define the layout here and let me just do this in the another button click. So on that button click on that button one click like this. Okay, no, not here in the screen on that button click. I will I will change that to Loki view to this one. So on that button click use this here, call it here and the layout I'm going to use here same as it is this one for this one and the URL I'm to use same like this but I want to use that width and the height is like something different. So suppose I'm to use your width is 200 and the height is like around also 200 and the padding from top is so uh, maybe 10 something. Okay 10 so I will make it 10 and then the busy color so background color you can use here. So let me just try color. Sometimes this color are probably not working for me. Actually, I don't know why this extension. So don't worry, use this. So if this will not work, so we will, uh, you can ask your question in the comment section or you can ask your question in that extension page here. Okay. So go to the MIT app inventor and the repeat is I'm to use your true like this. Cool. 
now that is the overall thing now let me just try how it's working or not so i'm using your emulator to run this app let's see how it's work so you can see that's our app here so that's the animation that we can uh, run in our mit app inventory screen and whenever i click on that button so this will resize see that's the 200 by 200 pixel animation so you can use that animation in your login screen in your chatbot app or anywhere in your app so this is a really pretty cool extension so if you need any help so just come down, uh, comment on the video i'll try my best to solve your problem thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe my channel like this video and share this video have a nice day be safe bye bye